The Rise and Fall of Floppy Disks Hey there, nostalgia seekers! Remember floppy disks? Let's take a trip down memory lane and dive into the story of these iconic pieces of tech. Back in the late 1970s, floppy disks were the cutting-edge storage solution. They started out at a whopping 8 inches in size. Then came the 5.25-inch floppy in the early 80s. These were more manageable and became the standard for home computers. They could store a massive 360 kilobytes of data. That's about one-third of a megabyte. Not much by today's standards, but it was enough to store smaller files during its time. The real game-changer, however, was the 3.5-inch floppy introduced by Sony in 1981. These were more durable, with a hard plastic shell and a sliding metal cover to protect the magnetic disk inside. Plus, they could store up to 1.44 megabytes of data. That was huge back then, and floppy disks were everywhere. They were the go-to for transferring files, installing software, and even playing games. But as technology advanced, floppy disks started to fade away. CD-ROMs, USB drives, and eventually cloud storage took over. The last major manufacturer, Sony, stopped making them in 2010. And thus, the end of an era. Today, floppy disks are like relics from a bygone era. For those of us who grew up with them, they hold a special place in our hearts. They're a reminder of a simpler time, when 1.44 megabytes felt like a universe of possibilities. So, next time you see one of these, recall the times it played a crucial role in the history of computing. Thanks for watching and taking this nostalgic journey with us. Don't forget to like, share, and drop a comment about your floppy disk memories. Until next time, 